Hey, Rizzy. How are you? Okay, say hi, John. Hi, John. No, that's your name. Say hi, Brittany. Hi, Brittany. Welcome week, we were in the same welcome week group, and I just remember she was really loud. <laughs> a day after I met China, China invited me to her birthday dinner, and it was at Brittany's house, and that's where I met Brittany. It was great. Uh, yes, very, very distinctly, yes. Wait, no. I, I, I don't remember. My first impression of Brittany Woolley was at um, the Christmas G Troop last, last Christmas and I thought she was a rock star. And then um, the night before bid day last year, a huge group of us went to BJ's and Brittany was acting really cool. And one of my friends and I were like, I want to be her best friend. Back to the questionnaire. I honestly have no recollection of the first time I've met Brittany Woolley. Yeah. Cool. It's just kind of a rush freshman year when I just met everybody. You were drunk? I was not, well. Uh, the first time I met Brittany Woolley was during Macbeth, whenever her brother was playing Macbeth, and I was a freshman in that production, and she was like standing backstage, and I was like, oh, I think that girl's gonna be, I think Brandon's sister's gonna be a major next year. Um, yes, but I can also remember before I ever met Brittany Woolley that um, my first introduction to her was Brandon telling me that my sister is going to audition for you and basically it's me with long hair. That's what, <laughs> how Brandon described her. Um, and he said but pretty much the same voice too. I think we like, might, might sing the same range. And um, I was like, uh, okay. Um, anyway, so, so I had that. And then um, I remember meeting her uh, at her audition um, and she blew me away. Uh, uh, at her audition, um, and yeah, we were super excited when she decided to come to Baylor. I don't think I do. I remember it being sometime freshman year, and she was doing some crazy crap, probably. No, but I do. The most fond memory I have of Brittany is whenever my mom came to our rehearsal of Whenever my mom came to our <laughs> rehearsal of Jonathan's Shakespeare scene, and my mom came in and she felt really awkward because she didn't know any of us college kids, and Brittany said hello and hugged her. And my mom always remembers her as the girl who hugged me. Brittany will be a superstar in 10 years. She will be on Broadway. Or she will be, or she will be like, um, some kind of huge, um, like, um, like, worship leader at like this huge church that everyone knows about and she's like famous worship leader that everyone loves. I think Brittany will be a star. In 10 years, Brittany Woolley is going to be famous in New York City and I'm going to be just a simple school teacher with her poster up on my wall and I'm going to be like kids. I used to be friends with her. No, I still am. I think in 10 years, Pretty Willie will be um, not in Waco, definitely. She definitely won't be in Waco. I think Brittany will be running her own theater company and starring in all this stuff. Mm. Oh man, Brittany probably has a family in 10 years. She'll probably be a mom and she'll be a great mom. I can see it. She'll probably have three kids with a lovely husband who's twice as tall as she is. Am I supposed to say like on Broadway? Is that like what you guys want to do? No. On Earth, she says. I hope so, because then we can be best friends. <laughs> I'm gonna say yes. Um, only, uh, only on certain days of the week. I would say no because I hate cats. But um, I think not because cats are sucky. I think she has uh, respect for cats. <laughs> no, she hates pets. Well, she doesn't hate them. She just doesn't think they are. Important, I guess. Mrs. Hannigan. 
Brittany has to play a munchkin <laughs> in The Wizard of Oz. I would love to see Brittany play um, whatever her, the title role in, in um, Jazz the Chaperone, because she sang Show Off for, it was for her Millie audition, mm -hmm. and it was awesome. When she gets a little ol older, she needs to play Dolly. Oh. Mm. <laughs> she really needs to play Dolly. Yeah. I mean, anything that um, Meryl Streep has done, I'm sure she would love to do. I don't know, her actual dream role. Oh, what? wait, wait. No, I don't know. God's blessed me so much with your friendship, and I can't wait to know more about you by living with you. And thanks for being my mom and just being the best friend ever. Brittany, just know that you are really awesome and you are such an encouraging person. Like, not just in what you say, but it is what you say, but it's kind of just like who you are. Your energy is encouraging to other people. Brittany, you're one of the best friends ever. I love you. Happy birthday. You're the best. You are one of the most special people in my life. I love you so much, and you know that you are a part of me, and you changed my life. I love you. You're so grown up. You're so old. Happy birthday, Brittany. You're awesome. You're lovely. You make my heart smile. Happy birthday. Uh, we're so <laughs> glad that you were born. We're so glad they came to Baylor. Um, I think you bring a lot of joy and life to our department. Um, I love how committed you are to everything that you do, and I wish you all the best on your birthday. On her birthday, I want her to know that she is a huge, 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 like, rock in my life. And um, she's so mature and so beautiful and so wonderful. I'll just say it to you in person. I would love to just say that I think Brittany is truly one of the most entertaining people I have ever met and that no matter what, she should not stop that. Happy birthday, Brittany! We love you. We're so happy to meet you, to know you, and to, you know, to work with you. You're so talented. God bless you today. Brittany, I love you so much. I'm so happy that you're in my life and that you're such a big part of my life. Happy birthday. You made it this far. You're doing great. Um, I love you. Happy birthday. I would like to say, happy birthday, Brittany. I love you. You're wonderful. Uh, you're a really wonderful person. And all of our lives are better because you're in it. And um, I couldn't even think of a better person. And I hope you have the happiest birthday. You're awesome. Are you 21? Yeah. Today. Don't drink too much or yell too loud tonight at the bars because it will ruin your voice. But That's have right. a great time and we love you and um, we yes, we think you're so talented. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Brittany! Happy birthday! Oh, happy birthday, Brittany! Go, go, Brittany! Go, 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 Brittany! Yeah, go, go, Brittany! Yeah, go, go, Brittany. Happy birthday, Brittany! Happy birthday, Brittany! Happy birthday, Brittany! Happy birthday, Brittany! Woo! Yeah, happy birthday! I want to see you. Happy birthday, Brittany! Yeah. Happy birthday! Happy birthday, Brittany! Woo! Happy birthday, Brittany! Happy birthday, I love you! Happy birthday, Brittany. Happy birthday, Brittany. Happy birthday, Brittany. Happy birthday, Queen Malta. Love you. Happy birthday, Brittany. 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 Happy birthday,
yeah. Oh, I feel like I'm really close to the camera, but <laughs> happy birthday, Brittany. You're really cool. Happy birthday, Brittany! Happy birthday, oh, wait, wait, yeah. yeah. Happy birthday, Brittany. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. <laughs> happy birthday, Brittany. Happy birthday, Brittany. Happy birthday, Brittany. If you want me to uh, happy birthday, Brittany. Brittany. Happy birthday, Brittany! Happy birthday, Brittany! Love you! Happy birthday! Way to be 21 with pride! <laughs> Happy birthday, Brittany! Happy birthday, Happy birthday, Brittany! Happy birthday, Brittany. Happy birthday. Uh, happy birthday <laughs> from Mike Schmaltz. I know it's been a while, but I miss the heck out of ya. <laughs> now, uh, birthdays of my age can be a pain in the drain, but I know you're turning 21, so I hope it's a party. Okay. <laughs> Hi, Brittany. It's me. So, I made this whole video, and I realized that I'm not even in the video. So, um, I just want to say a really fast word. I hope you have an absolutely amazing 21st birthday. Oh, and excuse the attire. It was a last minute thing, but I love you so much. It's your birthday. Are you ready to party? Hey, Brittany. Happy 21st. I'm jealous and I love you and I miss you um, and I'm excited to see you and I can't believe we're already juniors in college I don't know what's happening um, I'm so excited that you have a lead in Dirty Rotten Scoundrels and I can't wait to come see you rock it because I know you are um, I love you and I miss you Hi Brittany so this is probably going to be the most glamorous video that you receive for all of your birthday I'm wearing a Baylor Theater shirt, which you probably can't tell, and I'm in my super glamorous studio apartment in Portland, Oregon. Everyone wishes they could be as lucky as I am, but most importantly, I'm here to wish you a happy birthday because I'm a good brother like that. Also, I love you. We've been together and been through many, many trials and tribulations. And I hope that you have an amazing 21st birthday. And I hope you do what all 21-year-olds do on this glorious, glamorous birthday. So, have fun, be safe, and I love you. Happy birthday! Hey, hi, how's it going, Brittany? It's me, Thomas Ward, uh, and I just wanted to say hello, I want to say happy birthday, and I want to question why you're in Texas. It's so beautiful here in Minnesota. Not here, here, this is my basement, and it's dark, and it's kind of dungeony and, and scary, but um, upstairs is a door that leads outside and it's 70 degrees and there's trees and grass that's green and there's not you know just dirt flying around everywhere and loud loud pickup trucks and and people with hats and boots and um, and I'm fine with that but uh, I'll tell you I do miss a lot of people in Texas and you're one of them and I hope you have a wonderful birthday bye